Well, you. Loopy, what up, though? My guy, Hollow, what's going on, brother? You already snow. Hey, 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 shop your clothing line out. You already snow. We got the LOM clothing. We restocking on the 25th. Everything will be crazy, but we're here to talk about the young bull. Mm -hmm. The day before your battle, Resolution 2, Hollow the Don versus DNA. Yeah, we now, really look. I'm I know you got into this before, you know what I'm saying, on other platforms. Can you break this down to me? And the reason why I'm asking is, for the most part of your career, it seems like that I've watched online, y'all been going through the same the same thing, from the grind time to the king of the dots to the yeah. URL. Not everybody's done that. Yeah, now, nah, DNA came around grind time time. Around that time, I already did Fight Club, um, WRPs, yeah. 106 and Park. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, me, Cortez, and Conceited used to just show him love because we have more experience. But, you know, it becomes to the point where the, the little homie feel like he the big homie on the block. Much respect. You feel me? Much respect. Get your weight up, not your hate up. And now he mm. got to prove it. Now he got to prove it. So the, all that peanut butter and jelly bullshit he kicking going to go out the window once he see me. Ooh. It's getting high to here. Okay. Yeah. All that peanut butter and jelly bullshit? I'm saying, he said he dressed flyer than me. I mean, I'm just saying. He did say that. This is this is blasphemy to a nigga that sells, that, that sold a million dollars worth of clothes. Like, oh, wow. Yeah, what Congratulations. Is he, yeah, like, what is he talking about? Like, So I didn't want to argue with him, but I just want to let the fans know I'm turned the fuck up this week coming up. Um, okay. Ugly. Like, it ain't going to be no, oh, it's another battle, hollow, just taking it light and... Nah, I'm turning up. I'm undefeated on the app. It's staying that way. Oh, nice. Mama. Oh, mama. Hollow, can I ask you a question? Let's be honest, though. Let's be honest. All right? DNA's come a long way, bro. Got to give him his props. He's come a long way. Is he rightfully so? Should he be able to feel like he's better than you right now? Every battle is like the best. I get that. But with all he's done, and he's looking at your career now, is he wrong for really saying, yo, I'm that dude now, not you? Yeah, because the the accolades don't show it. The, he he don't be at the top of the cards. You can't you can't be the invitation mm. rapper opening the card and then want to act like you're one of them guys. Mm. Like he's not the accolades ain't really showing it. He's not really carrying himself like that. He's calling other people out. He's chasing Lux, chasing me. He's chasing battles. If he was that big guy and that guy like that, he would humbly sit back and get his flowers. And that's. Mm. What and then I answer these calls. You know what I mean? He said he caught me on the JC battle, so I'm answering calls this year. That's all I'm doing. My phone was zinging. I'm answering the call. Okay. Now, you and DNA have to have opposite stance, not stance points in your career, but y'all moved them. Y'all moved totally oppositely when it comes to battle rap. Yeah. He takes a lot of battles. You know what I'm saying? Does Definitely does his thing in his battles, and you don't take as many battles. Yeah. Why, why do you move like that? I'll be one deep. He's always in a group. Uh, I'm one deep. Yeah, we move real opposite. You say he's always in a group? I mean, what was it? What was the newborn the bugs at first? He had that click. And you go back. Um, DOA. And DOA. Then, you know, then it was NWX. And, you know, he's been in a couple clicks. He was like Team Homie kind of one time. So You was NYB at one time, though, to be fair. Yeah, I was NYB for like eight months. It was like eight. Can I ask you a question? Do you? Do you? Nah, but I was in YB. All jokes aside, but it was just like that. That was my lesson. Like I don't want to do this no more. I've never gotten another click after that. I learned okay. by you know. Who freestyles better? DNA DNA needs shit like this. I got the pen. I'll curl, then you gotta bring in my composition, put them in a composition. And then you gotta you gotta throw shit at DNA. You can lock me in a black dark room and I can freestyle for ten minutes. I don't need But that. is that whack though? No, that's incredible. That's fire to do. I'm just saying it's different levels. It's freestylers that need, you know, in a battle rap, that's incredible. But if we just talking rapping. Like, I don't need shit to freestyle off of and shit like that. I come off the top at any time. So DNA know, like, if he can do that, we can do that that day, too. Like, it can happen. It's a freestyle. It's free, right? True. Okay. Yeah, it's, they got a little better. Is this, this is for the King of Queens. Shout the gems. Shout the gems. It's already, it's already, King of Queens is already said and done. It's the fact. It's my young boy. It's the young boy. So 
I mean, that's already said and done. So how you feeling is this. You feel like, <clears throat> because you was the top dog, basically. You know what I'm saying? DNA should always show flowers. I seen an interview. That's the reason why I'm bringing this up on, uh, I believe it was 15 Minutes of Fame. You say he should always be humble. You're big on, on loyalty is what you said. Not, not the top dog. It's the fact that if somebody ever pulled you up and did okay. top, like, you know, Grizzle Mania, that was, I got him on Grizzle Mania. I made, you could look up a battle. I made him battle real deal in front of the store. I made real deal battle. And nobody would battle DNA in ground time. He couldn't get oh, wow. it. He was, he was three and, and two. He lost like three battles and one two. His record was horrible. He, he was looking like the Raptors out there. So we fixed him up. We helped him up. I made real deal battle. Look up DNA versus real deal. I made people battle. When niggas dissed him and, and called him a faggot, I went up to the balcony like, yo, that's my young boy. Who the fuck y'all talking to? When it was the Fresh Coast versus New York at that time. Like, so you should always just be humble, like, yo. And if you do want to battle, hit me up, like, yo, it's about that time. I'm about to hit smack. Let's do it. No, I watch, I'm in Houston. I see the JC battle. I mean, I don't even see the JC battle. He battled JC. He come outside like a lost puppy. Like, did you hear what happened? I'm like, what you talking about? He like, you just see the battle? Tell me he threw a shot at me. I'm like, congratulations. Mm -hmm. That's from heart. And you ain't used to, you ain't really feeling that. Nah, I ain't feeling that. I ain't feeling that. So we're going to see big uh, queens uh, on 26. Big queens. You feel me? Okay. Oh, now, I seen DNA said this could be the most disrespectful battle ever. Like, how, like, how do you feel about personal? How are we doing this battle right here? Yeah, I don't, I don't think that could be it because he's going to just regurgitate everybody else shit. Okay. That's what he's going to do is regurgitate everybody else shit. So... My shit is disrespectful. This like I'm disrespecting his life. This ain't gotta be. I bring up shit about you and expose you. This is just, this is just calling it what it is. You just dun dun dun. Stay in your place. Like don't do this. This this big queens. I promise. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna remind him of 012. I'm gonna remind him of the times like we was in the mall. I was like, who the fuck y'all looking at? I, I, I was about to. I done did a lot of shit. And niggas was spooked. Niggas was was scared to say anything to me. And niggas got hurt. Want to call me out now? So niggas was quiet when I was on the two thousand with the surf, the clips, the lux. The niggas was quiet this whole time. Niggas didn't call me out. Niggas don't call me out when I'm on my Mahatma Gandhi shit. So now I'm coming back out swinging. I done put the robe up. I done put the sage in the in the closet. You feel me? I done put up the the the, the shade butter is is in the bathroom. Like I'm on some bullshit now. I'm finna smack. Uh, again, this sounds good right here. I like this. Okay. I'm turn up. It ain't gotta get messy. If he wanna get messy, let him get messy. I'm I don't kick it like that. This ain't soccer. I'm finna go all bars. I promise. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's, so it's not a per I'm only asking because I've seen him say that. No, it it could be. Personal. It is personal, but it's not like exposing personal. It's like personal between me and him. I ain't you know what I'm saying? DNA mm -hmm. laugh at itself. It ain't nothing to really be like I'm more street than you. That ain't what I'm on with him, even though it seemed like it. It's just like DNA. I showed you weight for the first time. We was in your hood in Corona. He like, why the crib smell like that? I'm like, it's three plates in there. He's seen it. Nigga, eyes got big. This is when we wasn't making money off rap. I've been getting to the Gwitty. You can ask Arsh, Ice Goods. Like, all the peoples was getting packs from me. So I've been getting to this. Like, DNA just got money three years ago. He mm. just to the Versace store last year for the first time. You know, when they start talking, he dressed better. He said he just learned how to shoot a hammer. I got my first hammer at 15. Like, he, like this is like, you're new to this. He, he just got his umbilical cord cut. Like, he's just waking up to life. I've been doing this. So I'm about to remind him. You feel me? I ain't going to talk too much. We're going to leave it at that because it's going to get spooky on the 26th. I promise. Oh man, you talking that shit right now? Yeah, I ain't gonna hold you. Said he got me upset. So, yo, hello, man. I got some questions for you, man. Okay, <laughs> I got some hard body questions for you. Each and every one. What's I ain't up? gonna lie. I'm ready for it? I need it. I need it. All right, they all over the place. On top of that, all right. Mm -hmm. One. Do you regret the math battle? And I'm gonna ask. I'm gonna tell you why I'm saying this because after that is where it seemed like your status you. Kind of declined some. No, 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 of course, of course. Um, I definitely don't regret it from the lesson I learned. Okay. On the better rap side, I would say I regret it. On life, like lessons I learned from this shit and from how shit go, I don't regret it. But just okay. on 
the rap side, of course, because it's like, I know I could have got way crazy and, and did shit dirty. If I, like, people don't even know. I knew the shit he was doing the week before. Like, the niggas he was bringing out, like, I knew all of that the week before. That's why I was able to stand there just straight face, like, all right, Rob, come out. You team, come on, Rob. Because I knew oh. it before, but I felt like for shit going wrong and me not managing relationships right and falling out with people, I feel like I kind of deserved it. That's why I ate it. I was like, okay, I eat that. You feel me? Niggas is hot at me. I obviously did something wrong, didn't do something right. So I ate that one, but I didn't see the whole, like, niggas dragging the shit on and, and, the, and the exaggerated lies. I didn't see all that coming. So Okay. I think yeah, your car went on, had got broken into and all kinds of stuff. My, my car got broken into in Oakland? Yeah. yeah. Was it in Oakland? Yeah, that was in Oakland when I was at the King of the Dot Battle. They had nothing, but I heard niggas say I, I done, uh, the nigga gave me my car. Like a nigga would give a nigga Audi A7. Like I heard niggas say all type of shit that just wasn't true about the situation. Niggas want to steal my clothing on lomclothing.com. You feel me? Like niggas got me in court about to take my shit. Like all type of crazy shit niggas were saying. And like, we still, LOM Clothing, like we, we still here. Okay. So, okay. It's just like I, um, we got, okay. all right, boom. As far as this new era right now, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Do you feel like it's easier for them now or was it easier for y'all? I can't even speak because I ain't I ain't been well, in the tough room. You feel me? Well you see they're battling more rapidly now than y'all were battling. Which is hard. A lot of pressure on them because they're young making a lot of money. They're superstars. They're actually superstars quicker than y'all in a sense because 'cause they're getting pushed. Yeah, I seen something um, I was watching song with basketball. I forgot who said it. Um, but they said since players ain't guaranteed contracts and they get what they want off their potential, they don't mm -hmm. work as hard. And some mm -hmm. players had to come in back in the eighties and nineties and prove that they was an asset before they could get the big contracts. And that's okay. kind of Look, with battle rap, like, we wasn't coming and getting paid, so we had a certain hunger, a certain fierceness. Like, we was coming in there. Like I said, like, I was still doing street shit, like, battling um, up until 13-ish type of time. Okay. So, like, that shit really was, like, a different type of uh, grind when you went in there. Now you already getting paid. You already get a thought. You feel like, yo, I'm the man already. You get views, so it's hard to have that same. So it's just gifts. I think hunger, basically. I don't want to say nothing better. I feel like it's it's both got gifts and curses, both both errors. Okay, okay, okay. I've seen that you said that you would do a midnight madness if Sir gave the call. Yeah, no, no, no. We got to handle that. I got my cousin, uh, uh, M Dog. We we gonna bring him in in March. And um, if okay. niggas want to get spicy, like if you go off the top, like we could go off the top, like we do this for sport. You know, midnight madness off the top. Yeah, that would be dope. That would be dope. Oh, I think that will be fire. That that brings that brings us. It's, it's like Fight Club in a sense. It's like Fight Club cousins. You know what that was like, right there, bro. Yes, and, and that picture, like the like uh, who was that? Um, Chef Travis at Awar. Picture, I believe like, so. Yeah. How they fourth round was back and forth like that picture, of uh, just a, a battle like that. You feel me? That would be dope, right there. Okay, okay. Why haven't you battled Mook or Rex yet? Mook or Rex. That's a good question. That shit just ain't that shit just ain't work out how it's supposed to. I mean, me me and Mook had a contract signed in 2019. Niggas got paid for that shit. Shit still ain't happened. So, some so so y'all definitely have to battle. Was that how that works? Nah, that was three years ago. Some shit just ain't meant to be. You, feel you me? I mean Rex too? I Come on, man. One of them. No, nah, no, nah, I can't say the Rex battle. I'm saying the Mook battle seemed like it ain't meant to be. Me and Rex battle, like niggas really never like booked that or talked about that. Um. So, oh, so that's not, that's not really drawing any interest, you and Rex. Because me and Rex. At one point, y'all was going back and forth. Yeah, this is what happened. Rex was a bigger name to me. Then I felt like I was a bigger name, and we both did that to each other type shit. But at the end of the day, like, all shit is getting addressed this year. Didn't he call me out on your joint? I believe so. He says, yeah, he says something. But that was that was a minute ago. Though. That's what I'm saying. Like, I would, let, let's just be serious here. When it comes to New York battlers, right, you have a lot of battles in New York. Not that many, but, I mean... The, the, the top school. names, the Mook, the Rex, the U, the the the, 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 the Clips. Who else would you put on top? Math. Who else would you put on top? Quartet. Um, Quartet. Top, top? Yeah, if you said Math, I said Cortez. 
Is Cortez and Math in the same status to you? Yeah. And they're up there with clips in them? I always had this debate with everybody. Yeah. Um, nah, because I put clips like God tier. I put clips in That's what I'm saying. I kind of do too. Yeah, it's I put clips, Mook, Rex. I mean, not Rex, Clip, Mook, Lux. Like, niggas that reach a certain stratosphere shake shit a little bit. Not different. Rex? Rex, Rex, come on, Rex meant that stratosphere hollow. No, he's God tier for what he's done for the culture, but I'm talking about right now. Like, I don't have that, that trust that Rex can have around that'll shake the, the building crazy, like Lux would or Clips would. But Rex would like to have three is like. He, he was shaking that shit with the rum. It's honestly, if I'm going to call Spade a spade, he just got to lose like 20 pounds because he was shaking the shit with the rum nitty battle. But he yo, got that's it. Crazy. He got yo, it. yo, how would it be crazy? You can see him when they blow up, it's hard. Like, you're breathing. You this can see is, that. Yo, this shit is cardio. That's why I said, like, Get your running on and get in that bag, and Rex Rex should definitely shake some shit up. I hold you. Yeah, I definitely believe that. Look, look how he wasn't a total slaughter. I know it was years ago, but look how he ran through the house like that. He yeah. still got it. I hear what you're saying, man. So it's up to Rex, man. I hear what you're saying, though. Yeah. But yeah, that's that's all day smoke. That's all day smoke with niggas this shit. Okay, okay. Would there ever be a Hitman Holler rematch? And I'm asking that because when y'all battled before, y'all was the last battle. It was like one in the morning. You had the with mic the, issues. Yeah, with both the, top names right now. I mean, look, they want a Goods rematch. They want a Clips rematch. Like they want a Goods rematch too. That's what I'm saying. Want, All this has been brought up to me before, but it's like if I feel like I clearly won, I don't really. I do the rematch if fans call for it, but a person like Goods, uh, I feel like he threw that joint away. Hmm. Okay, okay. So you so you don't even feel like you had a need to even battle goods. You feel like you clearly won. Yeah, I mean everybody does. Okay, okay. That was okay. that that wasn't like nothing too crazy. But Hitman, that's a battle that didn't get the turnout. But still, that third round, I wigged. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know how uh, it would turn out now. But I, I ain't never thought of that, honestly. That's why I'm like this. I'm like, I ain't never thought of rematch a hit, man. I ain't never thought of that. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Is there a hit list you have at all for this year? No. Nah. you saying you want side, you want any smoke, but is anybody that you definitely want this year? There's only one cat in my eye I'm facing, and that's Eric. That's it. Damn, you just want DNA. You really want DNA bad as hell. Nah, it's already done. It's already locked in. It's just the fact of the matter is, like, this give me the feeling like the Arsenal battle should be a little personal sometimes. Like, the Arsenal mm. match was just, like, it was a little personal. So, this is just the same way. So, I'm turning the volume up. Okay. Okay. Um, Your return versus K-Shine and Rum Nitty. Mm -hmm. All right. When I say your return, I mean, you, like, when you started getting your shit back together and whatnot. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It was, it was odd. For years, since, I was, since the John John battle was my last shit on URL before that. Mm -hmm. So your, your return against them, how was you nervous coming back? Was what did you feel like these are the top names right now? So I gotta take them out or what? Yeah, it's always the same feeling. It's always that nervousness of aiming to do the best. But I feel like Rum was the best in a small room and K Shine was the best on the big stage. And you know, okay. I them both in their best elements just to challenge myself. You know, the I'm not hating that rum battle, I kind of feel like, bro. Yeah, it was it was and it was um it was warranted too because to give you a little background, like Rum had posted some shit, like I said, about the the fake shit niggas put out. And I, I just told the nigga, like, niggas ain't going to call me nothing like that to my face. Keep that shit in the battle because, like, I'm not really with all that playing. Like, I done been to the penitentiary, the jail, prisons. Like, I spent most of my 20s in and out that bitch. Like, nigga ain't going to play me. Like, my, my name, you could look up, Nigel Bennett. Like, it's extensive. Like, and my name is good on, on, on a few buildings in the island and the penitentiary in Texas. Like, you ain't gonna play with me with no paperwork and no rat shit. So that but guy... Why, but why would they, but why would they not have a... They, I'm talking about as far as them not responding to your bar. Oh, no, no, I'm telling you why, though. So me and him did that on Instagram, and he called Rich, and Rich was like, yo, Nitty bringing the, the little homies, the uh, Crips and Lowe's, she don't like how you get next from the gram, da 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 So that was kind of in the air, like, a few days before the battle, and I feel like them niggas came in and like, fuck this nigga. You know what I'm saying? Oh. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't know he called his homies and shit like that, but that's probably understandable why it was a little tension there and they ain't really reacting to uh, Nitty Battle. Because it was mainly all, you know, I ain't even flying no niggas from New York or none of my niggas came out. 
Like it was mainly just all uh, cats from the West Coast. It was Geechee people, surf people, nitty people, and they all low. So it was just like, nigga, this nigga really tried to take it to another level on the ground. Fuck this nigga. So. Hey, yo, I know it got to be crazy for you because before you, you was used to battling in New York. You know what I'm saying? Now that you're going all the way to the West Coast, it's like totally different now because there's other politics you got to worry about. I don't battle. Like, I don't battle in PA. Um, I don't battle in Houston. Well, I know you battle, but I mean with caffeine. As far as if you're going to be on URL, look at the politics you just named. You kind of got to think about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We fighting through all that. We fighting through all that. That's the challenge oh. that I'm up for. That's what I'm, you know what I mean? I'm hyped for that now because I done tested the waters. I did a small room, a big stage. Now I'm like, okay, I know what I'm up for. Now I could go in there. And your honest opinion, who's the present GOAT? It's me, nigga. Fuck that. that shit okay, I, I want to, okay, it's you? Get out of here, nigga. That's why I'm here to show. That's why I'm going to turn up on this nigga. And whoever claim they that, nigga, I'm coming to skin the nigga. Like, I'm not playing. Like, my shit is really, like, I, I really prepped my shit. Like, yeah, I got to tighten my shit up. I feel what the people saying. I could have did better my second, my third. Like, niggas don't want to hear that shit. Like, all that shit niggas saying I'm doing corny. Like, I dubbed that shit. I know what niggas think is corny shit. And, like, I dubbed that shit. I'm like, all right, I'm just getting on my, I got a different bag. So I'm like. I'm excited to drop my shit on the 26th. And then whoever claiming they the GOAT, I'm like, what's up? I'm with all the smoky smoke. What's hey, yo, I'm going to keep real true. I've always said this too, right? You're unorthodox, you're unorthodox as fuck. Now, what people don't understand is people like you, Cortez, Sharon, DNA, et cetera, Mob, one of them, is that y'all are more well-rounded than regular gun bar niggas because y'all was on grind time. Nah, Do you agree with that or not? Nah? No, 100%. You go to different bags, and that's why I think me and DNA going to have a crazy one because he could go to different bags. Like, I'm not sitting here expecting him to do what he did in a real sick battle because I put okay. time on it, so we ain't doing that long, boring shit. But other than that, you know, I What's think the time different. Um, We're doing 3.30 the first two and five minutes the third. You oh, know? shit. Yeah, because I, I can't have him put my fans to sleep with them long-ass five, six <laughs> rounds he was spitting. Like... That's just like, uh, 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 you know, the first two, five to third. Yeah, let's get straight to the dance. What is all this extra shit about? Cut the fat, nigga, put that hot shit in there. Let's go. That's what I did. Like, I'm going to just. Yo, this going to be dope, B. I just want to slow cook the fans a little bit because they already talking shit about me. So I'm going to tease them and then I'm going to just turn up. That's that's. Yo. And that's my game plan. I'm going to tell him the game plan and still, it's like Jordan could tell him what he going to do and still going to go in. You know? Yo, how long you real should be? A lot of niggas got you losing, bro. How's that make you feel? Motivation? You think they crazy? What? I need that. That's what's getting me like this. That's what got yeah, me talking like this. I'm like, I don't talk like this when I go in and everybody's like, hollow got it. I, you know, it's, I'm clowning there. Now I feel like my back against the wall, so I love it. Okay, I got a question. Would you ever battle Geechee? Of course. You know, I went back and forth with that, but I'm saying, of course, just by how, how crazy he been getting. Like, especially yeah. after I seen that Mike P shit, I was like, I kind of got to battle this nigga. This nigga's getting too crazy. Like, Really? Yeah, he was kind of tap dancing up there. Like, his whole shit was a little, like, I was watching it live. He was doing his numbers, so, but he's such, he like, he like a nigga, I feel like, like me, I feel like a lot of niggas drag shit on and 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 throw extra sauce on shit that might have really happened and make it seem crazy because I don't be doing no extra wild shit out here. I don't got a lot of shit on me. And Geechee the same way. He for the most part he a pretty solid dude. So niggas just pull up, bring up the tree shit and the and the, you saw weed like for mad years and shit like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Saying? So it's like hard to battle a nigga like that. You feel me? So I go hold you back and forth on it, but shout out to that nigga because he turned the fuck up. I think that would be a dope battle right there. With this whole new class you got now, like there's a lot of people you actually could battle who's dope, I feel like. Geechee's dope, I feel like. Yeah, uh, yes, B-Dot is yes. dope, I feel like. You said B-Dot? Yeah. Yeah, B-Dot. Uh, that's a hefty That's a hefty match right there. Yeah, B-Dot, I, yeah, I fuck with B-Dot. He's dope. Yeah, he's a different type of fight. A lot of these dudes are in their own way. Like, real sick. I rock with him. I think he's dope. See, this that's what I'm saying. Some people I'm cool with, so it's hard to say that it'll be a fight. Like, real sick, I just got off the phone with him not too long ago. But I feel like I'm, I want to keep that door open, no matter how cool niggas is. Like, that door got to stay open. Like, we have a competition. 
Easy. Easy, another nigga I'm super cool with, but it's like we here for competition. Yeah. He the only nigga I just found out he undefeated too. You know, I set a goal for myself, stay undefeated on the app. My, me and my son would check the app. He going to see if I lose. Like, I'm not, I can't play out here. I'm like, okay, you know, okay. Yeah, did you tell me you used to get a McDonald's? Ain't that your, ain't that your first son? Like, he going to be hot at me, I lose. Like, I can't play out here. So I'm okay. like, oh, just turning up on the preparation side. You feel me? T-top? I've never thought of T-top bad on URL. Tweeted it one day, and I was like, word? Y'all trying to start that? That's crazy. It is a lot of battles. I don't know. I never thought the only battles I thought that I would battle this year is Ill Will, Geechee, and, um, and then a rematch, like like Surf or Verb or some shit. You feel okay. me? Okay. I didn't think yeah. I you only done about three more times this year. Not that you probably battle more if you want to, but you you still pacing yourself like you usually do. Yeah, because I mean, if I if I battle more, then it gotta be like how you said. I gotta battle Ab. I gotta battle Chess. I gotta battle niggas like this. If I battle more than that a year, but I'm just pacing. You and Chess would be crazy too. Who? You and Chess would be crazy too. And that's a merit match because I feel like me and Chess got such a similar style and different bags we go through. He a little unorthodox. I don't know if niggas really call him that, but I feel like he got different bags he could go to. Yo, what's up with Cassidy, man? Would you ever battle Cassidy? I want to know, man. What's up with the ball? Yeah, man. Oh, what's going on, man? Ball, man? He said he could be surfing Rex at the same, they about the same time. He, I mean, he's the GOAT, he said. Now that I think about it. Man, he definitely said he the GOAT. The fuck out, boy. That ball shot the fuck out, man. <laughs> Oh, nut ass old head, man. I don't know about that old head. I like his confidence. Man. I will say that. Yes, man. Cass can sell air in a bag. Like, yeah. Cass got it. But we got to see what him and Freeway. All jokes aside, Cass, Cass is the forefather. He, Mount Rush. Cass be in Freeway. Yeah. Yeah. He, Cass he, got, he, he has to be Freeway, bro. But he got he to gotta beat his hitman performance. See that's how I be. But, but I mean, the way I look, true. But the way I'm looking at it, it's, this Cass Cass has been battling for a little second now. It's not like his first battle with Diz. He he's had a couple of times to improve. This freeway first time now. You already got the advantage on freeway, bro. Yeah, he, Cass is the clear. I mean, freeway the clear underdog. So Cass definitely got to show up for this one though. But I look at it like, yo, freeway's probably looking at the first one. You know what I'm saying? And he's like, oh hell no, you ain't getting this one. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I wonder what that whole put a beat on that that's been his career right that that's been following the whole time. People go people go more be wondering what free gonna come with than what cash gonna come with. Yeah. So I kinda think so too, yo. Yo, free might we gonna watch the battle. We gonna watch the battle. I <laughs> won the snap. We gonna watch the battle. Gotta, like to be real too, he gotta do extra shit for get to, he gotta like bring beans out, let beans do a fall. He gotta like, mm. you know what I'm saying? Like he gotta bring he gotta do like crazy shit, cause I feel like just off of rapping. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he got the battle rap in him, okay, uh, uh freeway. So I Yeah, he say he's been following the culture, so we're gonna see what's no. up. Are you wanna asking about you and daylight? No, free mm. my God. Me and daylight. Ooh. You and Daylight. Daylight definitely snaps. That's what I'm saying. There's certain niggas I, I respect they pen so much. I got to go into the mountains for I battle them. So it's a different type of preparation. Okay. One of them. Okay. Yeah, he be getting alien mode. You know what, Kylo? What's your thoughts on tournaments? Because King of Dodgers has a hundred thousand dollar tournament going on. Why wasn't you winning that? No, nah, I'm not a fan of, of me doing tournaments. I'm a fan of other people doing tournaments. Like, like the goal is to make a hundred thousand dollars without a tournament, and I'm I'm okay. past halfway there. So for me to even do that, like it don't make sense to do a tournament unless it's like you know a million dollars or something, and then I still want to get paid something just to do it because it's my okay. content I'm, I'm putting out there. Because your brand was not on the line. Yeah, because every time we do this, we got to think like. We Socrates of this shit. We giving out content that's going to be seen in 2,132 and still going to be viewed and, and people still going to watch it. So we just think about the now, but we got to think about 10 years from now, 20 years from now. It might be a new platform bigger than YouTube that come out 10 years from now and they need content from Battle Rap. You feel me? So we definitely got to get compensated as well as we can because we're giving away this content. 
Mm, that's dope right there. Let me ask you a question. What keeps you motivated to battle? Is it the money now or is it the battle rap, the hunger? It's always been both. It's always been both because at the end of the day, the, the money keeps me doing my clothing brand, uh, doing stuff for my son, helping other people I need to help. And then with the rap side, I can't not do it because when I didn't battle for like the few years you said I was chilling, all I had was the charity join and the two-on-two. I started doing hella music. I started dropping music videos, and, and I was like, damn, bro, I just can't stop coming up with this shit. So it's, like, fun for me to do therapeutic type shit. Mm. So it's definitely, yeah, you both. it's definitely both. Any nigga that say, like, oh, I'm just doing this for the culture, it's like, niggas have done shit just for the culture, like me versus Diz. I was like, yo, just give me whatever. Throw me a couple bands. I don't care. It's a surprise band. I was doing it for the culture. That happens, but it's very rare. For the most part, people do it for the money and for the love of the sport. You feel me? Man, you and Diz should have been three rounds, bro. It should have been. People, but people want to see that since grind time. It's over now. It's over. It's over. Nah, it's over. So what's, what's, it's a dub. It's a dub ski. It's a dub ski. Like, I, I ain't really. That's why I said the rematch shit is possible, but I ain't big on you it. Ain't, you ain't really thinking about battling Diz. Yeah, no rematches, really. I ain't thinking about no rematches. You feel me? So. Okay. Yeah, what was your favorite performance in all the battles you can remember right now? Well, you <laughs> thought you just... Huh? For me, it's just period. You? For me, uh, probably my past state one round. Okay. Um, my Tay Rock third round. My Arsenal first round. My Rum Nitty first round. Okay. Those are just like some of my, my best rounds I feel like just crafted. Mm. I feel How like hard is it to make three rounds like crazy. that? I got another one, Rum. I had B's and C's surround you. I'm from Rum. ISIS, our sunset. Like, I was blagging on that joint. I was like, niggas is being wild, quiet for my shit. Because even fans came up to me, was like, yo, I reacted. And a few people looked at me crazy, and I was scared to react. And I was like, yeah, <laughs> that's fucked up. They had it on Smash. So it's all. Yeah, they, oh, they mad at you because you ain't mentioned your Lux battle. They said my Lux battle is like automatic. I feel like that's one of the greatest battles, right next to Verb and Hitman or Mook and Jay Mills. Like that's like top three type shit. I don't gotta mention that. Okay. That's why okay. I think it's had this jargon about I'm not the same from the math battle because I had probably the greatest two on two battle after that. And I haven't lost on the app since then. I'm 3-0. and So all the battles I had after that, I'm undefeated on the app, and I had one of the greatest two-on-twos ever. But it's all this narrative from niggas that don't like me and fans and bloggers take, oh, he ain't hot, da 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 It's like my nigga, like, my first round against uh, K-Shine, I went crazy. The crowd was loving it. It's just the second and third round, and all three of his rounds they ain't like, so they ain't like the battle. Makes sense. <laughs> It don't be nigga. I did something there, so I'm out here getting booed or some shit. Niggas got booed that night. Like, <laughs> what the fuck is we talking about? Niggas choked that night. Like I'm up here giving nonstop. You ain't never seen Hollow say, "Hold on, give me a minute." You ain't never seen me even fumble a word, nigga. Like, and I'm doing this. I battle Shine and Rum Nitty a month apart. So it's like I'm just turning up regardless of what the the narrative is. But I want to remind niggas, like, nigga, look on the app. Check that 202 out. Check everything I did before the shit you got mad at me of, the shit you love from the surf, Lux, Clips, past Stage. Like, check all that out and don't forget that because that's how these niggas act like they done forgot. You feel me? So wait a minute. Do you feel like you're kind of underrated right now? No, 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 no. I just feel like it's a little narrative, how they say in battle rap, going around created by battlers or people. You know, I might have did shit to or, uh, you know, we done got into it or something like that. And they're like, Hollow's corny. For, for a while, it was Hollow's corny. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. he, he, he's grind time. So it's always going to be something. I'm just addressing the shit because it's getting a little out of hand. So I'm just like, yo, I done, I done took the, the robe off and shit like that. I done put, the, like, I'm on my bullshit, so y'all need to chill out. So that's all I'm saying. This nigga, I don't talk about this shit. I like this shit. I'm peaceful. And niggas try to take advantage of that. They see me doing charities and shit like that. Yeah, now I'm giving ass whoopings out now. I promise. I'm talking to niggas crazy. I'm not being like, oh, we was cool. And now nah, I'm talking to you like the little kid you is. Y'all gonna see on the 26th. It's like. The little kid he is. 
Come on, man. That nigga's a... Listen, we got to be real. D, they be some of the uh, top dudes, too. Who? Why? <laughs> Hold on, DNA beat. All right, in my opinion, it beat Chess. Even though Chess is messing up, he's he's top right now. We gonna go all the way back. We we can go back to grind time. I, I don't know how you wanna do it. Huh? Him throwing up DNA against Surf. That's what he inspires. You don't remember DNA dropping? Oh my God! The Surf had the white tee on, but DNA he thirty. Wait a minute. Wait. DNA beat Surf. He beat Surf. A lot of niggas beat, beat surf. surf. You all know that that wasn't a big accolade early on, like being Surf back then. If he beat Surf now, it would mean something. That was like so niggas didn't even watch that battle when them niggas battle. I swear, I've never watched him versus Surf. You know, is this why rematches are probably needed though? Because uh, you just said some real shit. Surf status has definitely risen twenty times since then. I said I don't think DNA could beat Surf now, but he did back then. A rematch card needs to happen. A rematch, a rematch card needs to happen. If it's a rematch card, I'm with that. We should make that happen right now. A rematch card. Who we need on it? I definitely need a, a me me versus verb on it. Ooh. <laughs> I'm so, yo, let me tell you something, bro. I'm tight. That's only two rounds, too. What's that? You and verb first battle. That's what I'm saying. That's why well, I'm tight. That was only two rounds, yo. It would be a perfect joint to rematch. What about, like, um... You and Verb, um, it's a it got to be battles that kind of got fucked up and shit. I think Tay, Tay Rock and Suge already did another one, did they? Yeah, they they already battled twice. Tay Rock and Suge. Who was it? That um, Chess and DNA. Mm. Are you us? Oh, just like ah, whatever. Yeah, I guess it's hard to do off the top. Niggas really got to think about battles that was... Because the best shit is like battles that was incomplete or a nigga just wasn't there that day type shit. And niggas read. Jazz and Hustle. Ooh, I throw Jazz and Hustle up there. That's yeah. Fire. Jazz and Hustle for sure. I can't think of another one off top. Like I said, that shit hard. But, but a rematch card would be dope. I ain't gonna hold you. And that would be a dope thing right there. I'm with, that's the two things I'm with this year. A rematch card or, or maybe a freestyle battle. Them the two. You can hold me. Are you battling twerk this year? Nah. Nah? Y'all too cool? Nah, twerk. I mean, come on. Shout out twerk, man. But, like... He's still with the rising stars, though, regardless. You do realize that, right? Yeah, but it's about the art. It ain't even about, like, the names or how dope. It's like, once right. he gets shit, shit consistently, like, he got... Get, get his shit together, then yeah. he'll take him serious. Energy. I'm not sitting here, like, twerk can get crazy on me 100%. Like, we know this. Like, Torch spares the fuck out. But I'm just saying, like, you got to take the art serious, so. Okay. Okay, I respect, I respect that right there. That's dope right there. Okay, okay. Have fat diabetes have an ass. I'm going to smack the shit out of him one day. He Ooh. is sweet. Ev, Ev fucking sweet potato pie eating ass. Like, <laughs> fuck wrong with that nigga? That nigga 54 and a half talking shit. He got great grandchildren. Oh, him. shit. That nigga's a nut. That nigga all with him. It's a couple niggas that's that if I hop out there crazy, they go they getting fried. I'm telling you. You said Av, who else? Who else? With me. Let's see what he do on the call with me. I think he on the call on the 26. We're gonna see what because yeah. if he turn up, like I'm I'm dead. He act like he ain't lose to the nigga I'm battling. Mm. What's the DNA? That was DNA's last win to me. I don't think DNA beat King Lowe's. I thought he mm. lost. I thought Los got the first two rounds. Los supposed to be lunchable. He an industry rapper. I would have packed Los up and sent him on his fucking way. Freestyle and all that. I would have left a half a round. And me and DNA could do that. I'll cut half my third and say, let's freestyle the rest now. We could give what? to do whatever you want. I'm telling you, like, like off the top, these niggas be making up shit. I come I, a bunch of something. I come with something, something. You think it's Thanksgiving. I punk this stuff. What is something? Like niggas will make up shit but they get to their punchline. Like they won't even make sense and talking about they want the best freestylers. Like that shit sound like you wrote it on an etcher sketch. Half them shits don't make sense. DNA said in a freestyle, I take your mother, pop a cherry. If you want to, how you gonna pop a nigga mom's cherry? It's his mom's. That means. Like, he'll say dumb shit like that. He said that live um, after he said I clapped the machete. 
He said, I'll take your mom and pop a cherry. This is the type of shit he said. So you find this? <laughs> oh, you say shit like that. Bro, I put it on Twitter. They posted one of our freestyles in a freestyle. He said, I bone the chrome. Every time I flow her dome, just to say home alone. Every time I flow her dome, the nigga is sped ed, yo. On the on the dead homies. He he ate classroom type of nigga. Like See here's the thing about it, bro. I agree with what you're saying, but I've seen DNA get busy. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Expect that Sharon battle when he when he would play Shotgun Sugar last minute. That was damn near freestyle battle. The Sharon battle. Yeah, bro. This nigga got a hundred and fifty battles. You think I seen most? Bro, of I'm not watching hundred and fifty battles of DNA, bro. I'm saying I've seen about eighty nine of hundred and fifty battles. Some some of these shits I might have not seen. I ain't seen the verse Sharon. Oh, that was gonna kick it a dot. But yeah, I mean, he's like a hundred. He got a hundred of. I mean, you do got mad battles, yo. Yeah, but you gotta give him props for that. No, you don't give props for that. You give props for quality. You don't give props for a nigga just doing anything. Anybody mm -hmm. can just do anything, but how, how much quality? It's like Lux said, it don't matter how many fights who you fought. Like, a mm -hmm. nigga can just do anything. Like I said, I made him battle outside the store. with real deal. Yo, battle right now, nigga. Spit something. Entertain us. We bored. Do something. Like, um, that's what he's about. I'm fucking around, though. That's, that's a young <laughs> I like to talk shit, because... Niggas talk shit, you know, but that's that's my guy. But these is all facts, though. You and DNA is going down, what, February 26th? 26th, lmclothing.com. Stay loopy, man. Invest in digital real estate. Get your cake up. Put some money in and get some equity in your life. That's all I be trying to promote. That's dope, right? Yo, hello, man. What's good? You got anything else you want to address? Man, no, no, no. We did everything. I feel like it's beautiful. I'm feeling good now. I'm about to go write some more because that's that's all I've been doing these last couple of weeks, just getting the pen tight and making sure the pen is tight. People respect it. That's it. Two three-minute rounds and one five-minute round. It's 3.30. The first two is 3.30. 3.30 and then a, the third five minutes. Yeah, yeah. We give a little window. If if, if you're getting crazy, I ain't going to stop him. I'm only putting okay. the time limits for the long, boring shit. If you're doing some boring shit and niggas is talking in the back and going to smoke cigarettes, I'm going to be like, oh, cut. Nigga, done. 3.30. Let's go. They want to hit hollow. You but know? if he on fire, you going to keep it going. Let's go. I'm going to be like, let's go. Because I want the nigga to turn up. I want to have a fire joint. I feel like this could be like Verb and Hitman. Nobody thought before Verb and Hitman battle. They like, oh, they cool. I don't think that battle going to be that crazy. Not knowing they have friction. And that's the same thing with me and this nigga. They like you cool, but we been had this friction since like we ain't been cool since like thirteen, fourteen. So that's crazy. Y'all ain't been cool since two thousand thirteen, two thousand fourteen. Yeah, yeah, he moved to Harlem. He moved to Harlem. So you know. And so y'all just stop messing with me. Y'all just stop fucking with each other. It's like the it's like when when a nigga hang out with all the niggas you don't fuck with, he eventually gonna have feelings or say something about you or he started hanging out with all the niggas that you know I was either gonna battle or, or we had words. So he went uptown, and it was like, all right. Then he eventually dissed me, which I seen coming. So I'm mm. like, So you've been seeing this coming in the long run. Yeah, because when a nigga hang with niggas you don't fuck with, it's inevitable. You know, he's hearing yeah. too much. He's hearing it over and over. Oh, I don't know, blah, blah. You know, so he did in the JC battle. I'm like, okay. And I was like, eventually I get around to it. And it took me five years. I apologize, but we here. Okay. Hey, man, good luck to both of y'all, man. Hello. We talking a lot, how long I see what you bring them in the 26th, man. I gotta see this. Hype, I don't even usually talk this much, but I feel like, no, let me let 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 some of the air get cleared about how I feel and, and how I feel like don't sleep on just cause in the joint on um, they had last week, I was just letting them talk. Cause I was like, you know, let them talk yourself in the hall. He, he said he dressed mm -hmm. me free. He said a bunch of dumb shit. Let them talk. But the day of the battle, I'm gonna be the one smiling afterwards. That's all I'm saying. So Oh man, talk that shit. Yeah. Yo, hello, man. I appreciate you coming on. You heard? You already. Easy, bro.